I was asked if it was possible to switch between trim modes of the trim tool in Pro Tools using a stream deck. I think this question came about because usually people end up right clicking on the trim tool and then selecting what mode they want to use. If you're switching a lot between trim tools, having one button to change between them would greatly improve your workflow. The way I'm going to demonstrate it here is using my Elgato stream deck and keyboard maestro tools. Okay, so in Pro Tools, the first thing we're going to do is set up keyboard shortcuts for the four different trim tools. We go to set up keyboard shortcuts. In the search bar, I'm going to look for trim. You can now see the different actions for the different trim modes. And you can see they don't have any shortcut assigned to them. So let's do that. Double click here, just for the standard trim mode, I'm gonna press all the modifier buttons and the number one. For the TCE trim mode, I'm gonna press all the modifiers and the button number two and I'm just gonna keep going for all four of them like that. Now that we have all four keyboard shortcuts, let's create the macro in Keyboard Maestro. I'm creating a new group called Trim Tool Switcher. We create a new macro for the standard trim tool. New trigger, USB device key trigger. We press the button on the stream deck that we wanna use. Add the action, type a keystroke. And then you do the shortcut you use for the trigger. And once, once you've done this, you just have to repeat it for all four trim tools with all the different shortcuts we created. And that's it. So you can see it was pretty easy to make. Now if we test it, you can see it switches between trim modes, really speeds up your workflow if you switch a lot between them. If you're interested, I'll have the macros and the template available in the description. I really appreciate everyone's support and I'll see you on the next one.